Hades 2 has finally been released in early access. I'm a huge fan of the original. Hades has dynamic and visually appealing characters, a phenomenally fun gameplay loop featuring tight and reactive controls that feel buttery smooth, and a scaling difficulty that works for players with a wide range of skill. I've been salivating for the second edition, where I can finally kill some time with Hades' second child, Melanoe. Boostroid has stepped up to offer the saga of the second scion of the underworld. Can Boostroid deliver the fast-paced action of Hades 2 the way the game was meant to be played? It takes about two minutes to get the game running from the Boostroid menu, which is on par from the time it takes my powerful home PC to load the game from my Steam library. Impressive, because Boostroid needed me to log into Steam in addition to loading the game. I do have my Hades installed on a mechanical drive and not an SSD, but it's still cool that Boostroid outpaces my machine. Framerate was immaculate. Whether I was in a critical boss fight or just dealing with Legions of the Damned, Boostroid kept up. The gold standard is a 60 FPS target to match their stream, and there is no slowdown or issues with that in two hours of play. Now this isn't to say the game looks perfect. Sometimes there seems to be a dulling effect on games with Boostroid. If you look at my visuals side by side with some gameplay from my home PC, you can see there's a loss of vibrancy in the colors, though it wouldn't have been noticeable had I not been playing on multiple platforms back to back. It doesn't really affect play at all, but I do slightly prefer the brighter colors from my local device. Sound stayed high quality until about an hour into the session. Then there was some crackling, audio distortions that can be fixed simply by reloading the stream. So if you're doing longer play sessions, you may want to refresh the stream after every couple runs if that audible fuzziness starts up. What about the gameplay? This is the most critical aspect. Hades 2, like its predecessor, relies on reactive controls for much of its appeal. The game feels a bit clunkier than the original Hades, but that has nothing to do with Boosteroid. I have the same issues locally, where it seems like Melanoe in the sequel isn't quite as reactive or agile as Zagreus was in 2018. If we compare Hades 2 to itself, I really couldn't tell the difference in control playing on Boosteroid versus my local device. Melanoe handled the same whether I was on the cloud or not. When it comes to this vital feature, Boosteroid did come through. All my commands were registered immediately, and she was very responsive. Input lag was not a problem at all. There are plenty of interpersonal moments to enjoy where your latency is going to be irrelevant, but you're going to need to be able to perform in combat to make it through this game. Keep in mind that when I ran my speed test, I was enjoying sub-25 latency. Your latency to Boostroid can change how reactive that gameplay is. When I was playing PAL World, I was getting over 70 MS that night and I bet I would have felt that extra lag if my latency was that high during any of my Hades 2 gameplay. Steam cloud saves worked without any issues, though always be mindful about them when you load up. This goes for any game you play on Boosteroid. You may need to give Steam an extra moment to catch up at the beginning or end of your play session to ensure you don't lose anything. It'll only cost you a couple seconds every time, but it can lose you hours of progress if you're impatient. The verdict is recommended. Hades 2 played extremely well on Boosteroid. Besides some minor nitpicks regarding the stream, great experience, 9 out of 10. If you can catch that low latency, there's nothing else to worry about. The game looks good, plays perfectly, and functions exactly how you'd expect. Nothing is missing. You can dive right into the underworld on Boosteroid. Quick dip. <laughs> if you enjoyed my review of Hades 2 on Boosteroid, please like the video. If you're looking to try out Boosteroid, Use the link in the description to support our channel. Subscribe to keep it tuned to the only place you can do battle in gaming heaven, Cloud Gaming Battle. I'm Little Quick, having a hell of a time killing time. The same predictable result, yet you persist.